Here's how to set up your Amazon Alexa Echo Smart Speaker. We'll be setting up Alexa on a third generation Amazon Echo Dot. The steps are similar across all Echo speaker devices. To start, you'll need to download the Amazon Alexa app on your phone. When you open the app for the first time, it'll prompt you to log in with your Amazon account. If you don't have one, choose register. Then you should see a list of users on your Amazon account. Choose your name or register a new user by pressing I'm someone else. Next, the Alexa app will ask for permission to send notifications to your phone. You can choose allow or later. Now, plug in your Alexa device to power. Once you plug it in, the light will turn orange. Hello, your device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. Next, Return to the Alexa app. Press on the Device tab on the bottom of the screen. Here, press on the plus sign on the upper right-hand corner. Then choose Add Device from the pop-up menu. On the next screen, press on Amazon Echo. Then choose the option under the Echo Smart Speaker group. The app will ask you if the orange light on the Alexa Echo speaker is on. If so, press Yes. If your device didn't turn orange or the light turned purple, press and hold the action button on the top of your device until the light turns orange. Back on your phone, the app is going to search for available Echo devices near you. You should see your device name in the menu. Press it. In the next menu, select your home Wi-Fi network. It'll then connect your device to the internet. Once you connect, you can choose where your device is placed in your home or skip it. Then, you can add your address in for local results, like for weather or restaurant recommendations. You can also skip this step. Now, your Alexa is ready to use. Your Echo is ready. To personalize your Amazon Echo device, on the Alexa app, press on the More menu on the bottom right corner. In the next menu, press Settings, then under Device Settings, choose your new device. Here, you'll be able to change the device name, change its wake word. Echo, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. You can also change the device language and other configurations, like connecting to a Bluetooth speaker. Now, your Echo device is personalized to your liking. Alexa, what's the weather? Right now in New York. With Alexa Echo devices, you can also set up skills, which work pretty much like apps on your phone. To find these, from the home screen on your Alexa app, press on the More menu on the bottom right corner. Press into the Skills and Games tab, and it'll navigate you to the Discover tab. Here, you can browse different skills. You can also press over to the Category section, or press on the magnifying glass on the top right corner if you know what you're looking for. For this example, let's set up Spotify. Press on the magnifying glass, search for Spotify, and press into the result. Here, choose Enable to Use, and it'll send you over to Spotify's login site. Put in your information and press Login. Then, it'll ask you to agree to Alexa using your Spotify app. Press Agree. Next, it'll let you know that your account has successfully linked. You can press Close, and now Spotify is enabled on your Alexa Echo speaker device. Alexa, play Spotify. Here's Spotify. There are many skills that don't require login information. For those, assuming you know what skill you want, you can just ask Alexa to enable it. Alexa, enable guided meditation skill. Okay, here's guided meditation. And don't forget, your Alexa app can do almost all the things your Echo speaker does. All you have to do is press the round blue button on the homepage of the Alexa app. What's the weather? In New York, it's 40 degrees Fahrenheit with cloudy skies.